What is up fellow earthlings? Welcome back to the channel Austin Hustler Hires. In today's episode I'm going to be delivering a couch that I'm selling for $200 and we got paid to remove the couch which is amazing and uh, this is the best kind of couch flipping guys. Couches you get paid to remove and then they're good enough to resell. So uh, speaking of the Rage Room, I just want to give you a quick update on that. We've been getting at least uh, four people in a day, which is like two groups of two. Normally they come in in, in groups of two. Uh, so four people a day coming in for the last three days. And today is Saturday, so we're expecting you know at least four to six people to come in between 2 and 10 p.m. tonight. Those are the hours we decided we're going to be open from Monday to Saturday, 2 to 10. And then on Sunday, we're going to be open from 12 to 8. Oh, and of course, you know, my son's sleeping, so he's the only one in the truck with me right now. <laughs> we need to let him get as much sleep as possible because, you know, lately with all of the schedule change, they're homeschooled kids, and we do our best to kind of hold homeschool them while we're here, and we built this little room for them like you saw in the last previous video. If you didn't see that video about the new setup in the Rage Room, I will put a card right here, and you can go ahead and just click that after you're done watching this video and uh, go check out how we set up the rage room it's pretty freaking awesome i don't know what i'm saying let me go ahead and stop rambling and get this video started without further ado i'll see you there Alrighty then guys here we are inside the shop my wife just left to go pick up those baseball bats that i was talking about and this over here is the couch that we removed and got paid to remove and now we are gonna go ahead and sell that couch and deliver it today and charge a $25 delivery fee so you really can't beat that also there is a black recliner right there over my shoulder I have someone coming around 6 o'clock today they're gonna come pick it up from the shop I have it up for 75 bucks they said 50 I said 65 and then they said 60 and I gave them a thumbs up on that Speaking of thumbs up, go ahead and give this video a like, guys. Please, we're trying to get these videos up over 100 likes per video, so all I need is your help. I know if you're watching this still, you heard this out of my mouth, so please just hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe down below and hit the notifications bell so that you can get notified every time I put up a new video for you to watch. So anyway, let me get to that, guys. I'll update you here in just a few minutes. Shoo. Woo! Just got done sweeping and now I have to mop the place. Probably wondering why the heck is there an iron in your hand, Austin? Well, that's because my kids are uh, doing a little bit of, doing, having a little bit of fun, I should say. I don't know why I said doing a little bit of, yeah, I mean, you remember these things, guys? Where you like, let me take the wax paper off, I'll let that heat up real there, right there. So it's like these little circle, circular things and then you can like, put them on these pads and then you put the wax paper on top and then you melt it and it turns into you know the shape that they made so that's my son's pokeball there and my daughter actually made this little pokemon what's that pokemon's name does anybody know um, I'll check. he's he's gonna go check on the pokemon name status but uh yeah that's why i have this iron here we're gonna go ahead and iron those out and see how they turn out basically they're making their own toys <laughs> Right, let's see if we can, oh, oh, oh. So just like, do like this, right? Yeah, then just. Oh, God. All right. Oh, that's not done yet. Hey, look at his name. All right, let's uh, fill this guy off here. Shake it. Shake yeah, it like a Polaroid picture. Shake, shake, shake it. So guys, I have someone coming in to buy that recliner and I have this couch uh, sold today. I'm going to deliver that. Someone just walked in to buy this couch. So let's see if the sale goes well. See if I ca capture it on camera. Hello, hello. Can I say hello, Matthew? What's up, man? So what do you think about the couch? I like it. It's in really good condition. Whoever the person that had it before just really got good good shape because you don't find them in the shape. Can you let her admit it because she's awfully heavy? 
She on a diet? That's why she's on a diet. <laughs> As a Chihuahua? She's a Chihuahua um, Pomeranian mix. Oh, okay. Oh, no. so she's a pretty big well, Chihuahua. Grab her by the, don't put her down. I told him we would keep her in arms. Oh, it's, it's, she's okay, as long as she doesn't pee or poop. No, she I'm doesn't. <laughs> she's got that under control. That's, that's fine with me. Yeah. She's not a puppy. Okay. Didn't you have this posted online cheaper than the 275? Uh, maybe 250 we might I have. I think that was closest to Yeah, it. I'd be willing to go 250. Three, every which way is Yeah. Right, well, let me ask you um, yeah. a question. Yeah, what's going on? We, we are not moving our furniture in the house until Saturday. Okay. Can you hang on to this until then? Yeah, if you want, if you pay for it now, um, I can put sold on it. Okay, so I'm not sure if I showed you guys this yet, but this is obviously our new chalk wall here, all black. And those are the prices up there. We've got Rage 1 for 30 bucks, which is one person, one earthling, 15 glass items, and one small item. We've got Rage 2 is made for two people, but any one person or two people or three people can purchase any package. Over here we have our daily deals and as you can see on Monday is appointments only so we're not going to work Monday unless we have any appointments. Tuesday is half off the Rage license which we charge $10 for so if they come in on Tuesday they get the Rage license for $5 and that's only a one time charge so uh, if they come in on Tuesday after that then they just get the $5 discount that is on the Rage license. And I'll go ahead and show you that right now actually. So this is the Rage license here. Let me see if I can get that in focus. Come on, camera. All right, so annual Rage room license. The license is good for one year, and they must be renewed annually. Thank you for smashing safely. And it says $5 off each time you spend $50 or more on a single visit. Guys, I am going to be coming out with a whole store of merchandise like my fellow Earthling hats. We're going to have fellow Earthling shirts and it's just going to be a huge brand that I'm going to create over the next five years and I hope to grow um, into uh, more than just a rage room and I hope to grow this rage room into a franchise and maybe some of you in the future can actually you know join in on the fellow earthlings rage room franchise if you like the idea and you like the way I do things you can join in partner up with me in the future put one of these rage rooms in your city and start making some money and just be part of the fellow earthlings franchise um, so yeah, we're going to have lots of apparel and we're going to be doing lots of cool things with the fellow Earthlings brand in the future. And you know, I started this brand obviously with YouTube. When I start my videos, I say, what's up fellow Earthlings? And that's because I wanted to be able to address everybody and anybody that wa watches my videos. And if you're watching this video right now and I say, what's up fellow Earthling? Unless you're an actual alien, then you can't tell me that I'm not addressing you correctly. So make sure to smash that like button for me figuring out a clever way to address everybody equally. And uh, go ahead and subscribe down below for more content, guys. I'm going to go ahead and get back to what I was doing here. Just want to give you a quick update on the wall there. And I'm probably going to eat some lunch too. I got some tuna fish and crackers today. I'll see you soon. All right, so she just got back with the new weapons of destruction, guys. We've got a bunch of baseball bats and tennis rackets here. And now we're fixing to get this couch loaded up and put it in the truck out there. And I'm going to go deliver it to this lady. Right after I stop by the office, I have to pay uh, Brandon and Isaac today because today is Saturday. And uh, then I'm going to go deliver this couch, see if I can get one of them to help me out. Okay, close the tailgate, got the couch all loaded up. I'm gonna put the dolly in there because if I have to do it by myself, I'll use the dolly to kind of load it into the lady's house. All right, headed out to the office and uh, we're gonna pay the guys real quick. See if one of them will come with me to deliver this couch. We're gonna go make some money. Come along for the ride, guys. Come along for the ride. 
I said that kind of retarded. Come along for the ride, guys! <laughs> and that one was just a little bit more over-exaggerated. Yeah. So anyway, all right, guys. So anyway, we're. I just dropped uh, dropped off the the payments to my boys, and I said, you know, who wants to stay a little bit later and help me out? Brandon volunteered, so he's actually right behind me, following me to this lady's house. Uh, sorry for my camera's moving around; it's on the dashboard right now. I just had to tell you this though. I called the lady. Woo, it's running away, run away camera. So I called the lady to uh, let her know we're on the way to deliver the couch. And apparently, I guess she lives in like a nudist community um, because she said, yeah, you know, no problem. She said, I'll be here. Would you be more comfortable if I was clothed? And I, she caught me off guard with that question. I was just like, uh, well, yeah. And so she said, OK, well, I'll put something on then. But I just had to share that with you guys. That's the first time I've ever been asked that question, um, I think ever from anybody from people that I don't know so definitely threw me off and it was pretty funny so hopefully she's got like everything on because uh, she's definitely an older lady and I'm not sure I want to see all that anyway guys uh, it's probably not safe to be recording and driving at the same time I don't recommend you do this and I'll let you know when we get there so in this clip, I forgot to turn my microphone on, so there's no audio, but I'm showing that I got paid from the lady that we dropped the couch off to, and she also gave me a tip, a little bit of extra money for moving some furniture around while we were, while we were there. And in this part of the clip, I actually looked over and saw a completely naked lady walking through the neighborhood, and I was just baffled. It was uh, not a pretty sight, to say the least. All right, guys, so I'm back at the office here. There was a change of plans. Oh, wait, let me get my key. There was a change of plans. Uh, after I dropped that couch off, I was headed back to the rage room with just my truck. Um, but turns out, Kelsey has four people actually raging out there right now as we speak. So it was uh, two parents and their two kids. One was uh, 14 and one 15, I believe. So what I'm going to do, and also she informed me that we got another booking tonight for another four people. So right now what I'm doing is I'm going to drop off, let me roll this gate back first so y'all can hear me. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this Freightliner here and I'm going to drop off the dumpster that's on the Freightliner. And then I'm going to hook up to my trailer and then I'm going to pick the dumpster up with my trailer so I can bring my truck. Um, the only reason I'm doing that is because I can't fit my family in the Freightliner. And right now the only vehicle we have for the family is the GMC. And uh, then we have this Freightliner for work <clears throat> for doing all the jobs.
Okay, all right, before I leave, one more thing I actually forgot to do, guys. My Airbnb guest told me that the breaker blew in the Airbnb, it's only a 30 amp breaker. So I'm gonna go ahead and switch, switch it off and switch it back on. So for some reason, um, damn it, hold on, let me get this thing closed. Fuck. What the fuck? Ah, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Let me, uh, I gotta take a picture of it real quick for the guy too. So let me put this thing up. And, uh, ch -ch -ch -ch. quick picture. Bada bing, bada boom. And I'll get one from over here so he can see where it's at. Yep, just like that. Okay, so I got the 30 amp breaker turned back on for the gentleman staying in my Airbnb. He's not here at the moment, he's at work. All right, just got back to the rage room here. And this is the uh, carnage from the last ragers. While my beautiful wife and my beautiful daughter are cleaning this up, I'm gonna go out here and I'm gonna get this dumpster rolled off in front of our, our roll up garage. And uh, then we're gonna get everything into the dumpster and get it reset for the other four people that are coming in tonight and who knows there may even be more people because we have a special come uh, we have a special going on tonight where you get 10 free glass items if you come in on a Saturday so here we go let's get this done tell you what this is the first time we use this larger rage room area in here and my wife did a great job figuring out what to do while I was out delivering that couch in the nudist community. <laughs> and uh, so when I got back, I helped him clean up as you saw. And we have another four ragers coming in tonight. So uh, this is the first day and this is the first day that we had a four rager group come in that wanted to go all at once. And uh, it turns out we have two four rager groups coming in. One uh, came in earlier, that's what we just cleaned up. And then we have another one coming in at what, 7.30? And so when they get here, we'll be ready with this bigger room. I have my ACs behind that wood right now, kind of cooling the place down. And uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get it set up. This is probably gonna be one of the best days we've had here. My wife is headed out to go get some water and some Gatorades because we ran out of stuff to drink here and uh, yeah I'm gonna finish there's a few small piles around here I gotta finish sweeping up but I appreciate you guys watching this video and uh, make sure to hit that like button if you're still watching this hit that like button down below whatever you gotta do to get to you know minimize the screen go down below hit the like button for me whether you're on your phone or your computer that'll help me out greatly I appreciate you and we'll talk to you soon.